Hey friends, I hope you are doing great. And today we are going to write a simple C program that can take a file, a C file as a in as input, and then it will remove all the comments from that C file and output that into a new file as a new file. Okay, so let's get started. Okay, first save the file. Remove comments. Okay, from C dot C. Okay, inside our nothing folder and include stdio dot h and main function. Okay, so we need uh, two file pointers. Let's say one is for input, and that will be if open, and you must provide the path of the file, or if it is in the same directory, then you can just give the name. So I have a file there that is example dot c, and we need another file pointer for output if open okay i need to keep the mode here that i want to open it in read mode or write mode so the first one we don't need to open it into write mode because we are just going to read from that file and you the output dot c that is going to be going to be the output file and we need to open it into write mode okay so in case of write mode you if you don't have the file already it will create the file so no problem okay we have both the files now and what else we need we need uh, characters to read the store the characters when we read that from example dot c and then let's start the loop and c is equal to if get c that is how we can read one character from example dot c okay and we need to provide the file pointer and if it is not equal to not equal to end of file that is a macro and that return that is the value is I think minus one so when if get c reaches the end of the file it will return minus one so we are checking that until then the loop will loop will ro keep rotating and to check it is a comment or not so first of all we need a forward slash okay that's the thing that can say it is a it can be a comment or not so if c equals to forward slash then it can be a comment okay so let's uh, read the read another character okay so let's uh, read the next character and okay so we have the next character now and if it is a c if it is another forward slash that means it is a comment because we have two forward slashes and else if c is equal to a star that means it is a comment also so these are the two cases we have now and we have to we have to use a flag here because that these two conditions may not satisfy okay so if the, both the condition doesn't satisfy that means that was a the first one this one was a simple forward slash that means it was a division sign 
maybe so that's why I'm going to use a flag so if it enters into this one then also flag is going to be one if it is entering into this one then also flag is one and if both the cases is false if a flag is still zero then we are going to just uh, uh, enter this uh, division again into the new file that is our out pointer file pointer okay and here what we can do is we have both the forward slash now that means it is a comment so we need to go until we get a new line because this is how we give a one line comment like this this is a comment so it works only in one line okay so this is here we have a new line character actually so for that what we can do is use a while loop until we get the new line if get c and in and until we get the new line not equal to and we are going to close the loop here with a semicolon because we don't need to do anything inside that loop we are just going to read it until we get the new line okay so that's it for that one and this one is a little tricky because we need uh, a star okay and while the let's read another character and from in of course and then we are going to check if it is not equal to end of file okay and then inside that we are going to check that it is the end of that comment or not that is the multiple line comment like uh, we do okay let me show you here so slash star and then star slash so this this is the thing we are going to check now okay read the characters and if it is equal to star so when it is ending the star will come first then the forward slash if it is equal to star and then again if it is equal to forward slash that means this is the end of the uh, comment and we just simply going to store a new line to C because uh, C will have the slash here because that's the last character it read okay so we don't want to print that slash because that's the part of the comment so we are going to just give it a new line and then break from here okay and I think we are done now so save it and okay I just have to so this is this okay and this is the end of the while loop and after that I'm just going to close the files and we have in and then we have out yeah out so save it and then go to terminal and let's compile it okay and gcc remove comments from c okay and there is no syntax error and dot slash a dot out and it is run it didn't give any error that means we have our output file and what was the name out dot c okay 
so inside our nothing folder we have let's see first example.c so this was example.c and let me just minimize all this Okay, I have done something wrong, I guess. So just give it, uh, just give me a minute. Okay, I forgot to just put all the character into the file output file. So we need a general common input. Okay, so for that, uh, f put c and we need to c put c into the output file. Okay. So when it is not any kind of comment, so we are just going to, that means it is not going inside this if, okay, so after that we are just, just going to print the character, it is just a simple character. So let's go here and compile this again and run it and then we have our files, okay, reload it and this is okay so now you can see both the files so the first two lines were the one line comments and then this is just a division and this is a multi-line comment from there to here and this is again one line code and this is a comment which just beside it and it removed all these and these were the three lines that are actually the code so this is what you get here as output so that's it for this video see you in our next video hope it would help someone okay bye for now